I'm just going to be doing a quick video on how to process your lambs. This little guy has already had his selenium, so that will be in another video. But I'm just going to give you a quick show on how I'm tagging and docking my lambs. So the tags that I'm using are Shearwell tags. The reason I like them is because they fit into the same applicator as your CCIA tags or your NID tags for those of you who don't call them Canadian Cattlemen's tags. Anyways, my process for identifying ram lambs and ewe lambs out of quick glance is I do ram lambs in the left ear and ewe lambs in the right ear. So, because this is a little ram, he's going to go in the left ear. For placement, I prefer, especially on a registered lamb, which this is, to be, if you divide it, your ear into thirds. So one, two, three. I prefer to be in the center or a little bit closer to the ear in that third. And you want to stay away from the ridge, if possible. Now, this lamb is a couple days, sorry, it's about 24 hours old. I like to get my lambs done within the first two days, if possible. So, right there, crunch, and there's your tag. Now, for commercial sheep, the tag placement isn't as much of a big deal. However, on your registered stock, especially for those that are going to be tattooing your animals, you want to make sure that you're leaving enough room to tattoo up in the top of the ear or along the side. Now, for the docking, Again, uh, I prefer to have mine a little bit shorter than uh, a lot of the longer docks that would come down to here. However, complying with the New Canadian Sheep Breeders guidelines, I do dock a little bit longer than I used to. So, just want to zoom in here. There's your colloidal fold. I just go down to the bottom of that. Usually, that's going to equal out to the second joint. I'm going to be very careful on where I'm putting this. Personally, I don't like the look of a long dock, so I take an extra second to make sure it's exactly where I want. So if we put this little guy up here, you can see from the side that it is past the colloidal fold, but it's going to be shorter than covering that. The reason that I like to dock right in that spot is because, number one, I just like the look of it. Uh, from a showing background, you're going to make it look like there's more hind quarter there. Optical illusion. Another reason is because of fly strike. I'm from Ontario, and even here in Alberta, fly strike is a real problem, especially on your wool, your breed, yeah. like self downs. So I want to make sure that no manure or urine, if it's a yo, is getting on that wool and going to attract flies. You're just helping to cut that out. All right, so this is our first video on how to process your lambs. Hope you enjoyed it. Have a good day.